just for you. I got you back to a new Simpsons review, and we are reviewing the recent new episode of season 36, and it is this season's Treehouse of Horror. Yep, we have now rates this season's Treehouse of Horror. And it's definitely quite an interesting Treehouse of Horror as well. Of all the Treehouse of Horrors, this is a definitely an interesting one. And yeah, we have this cool little opening to it as well. Which I like the art styles of it too. And we start with the first story. And yeah, so with these lights that Lisa's presenting. <laughs> this light thing that Lisa's presenting. And everybody's just starting to fight and... Causing this thing to crack in the ground. And the nose is just talking about with this. And causing these monsters to come out. That's destroying all the buildings. And of course Bart is thinking this is cool. And causing more monsters to come out. and everybody, Because there's a blue and a red side of causing these monsters to happen. And again destroying more buildings. And Professor Frank has an idea of how to get rid of these creatures, but the people that he was going to have got killed. So the so they get Bart and Lisa to have to take out these creatures. And they get in these suits, and Squiss Otto as well. And Homer gets knocked out with this donut and starts rolling. And, yeah, they start fighting the monsters and taking out the original monsters and causing the other monsters that appeared to flee. And then we see three news cycles later, it's just back to normal. <laughs> I mean, it's just going all over again. And then we go to the next story, the fall of the House of Monty. And yeah, it, star it starts with Homer and everybody just finishing this syrup place working and then they're having to build this house and yeah they're talking about the or some of these um these graves and mr burns gives them a face a thanksgiving face and yeah it looks pretty nice and then they're having to do the whole bone pulling the bone which yeah willie pulls it and yeah they manage to win but yeah he manages to dump the food before they can eat. And yeah, of course, Mo tried to get af go after it. And then, Monty's, or Mr. Burns' ex-wife tells him that he'll be cursed for not offering a feast. And yeah, we see Homer literally die, or starting to get burned to death, and causing everybody else to as well. And then, Mr. Burns is just hearing different things happening, even when he wakes up, and he starts to see ghosts of his dead employees. Yeah. Trying to get revenge on him, and wanting to gnaw, gnaw on him, even seeing his dead ex-wife in the process. And he thinks that giving them a face will help, but no, they just pass the face and start making it look moldy. But yeah, he just... He goes and jumps into the fire, which, yeah, he gets dragged into hell as well. And causes the whole place to explode. And, yeah, DC Smithers and Sideso Mel say the remains of Mr. Burns. And then we have the last story on this season's Treehouse of Horror. And it is quite an interesting one as well. Which, it's all about Janes. Yeah, Homer just trying to get find some Janes because he wants he wants to impress a waitress which is Marge at this diner and we see these lightning strikes and see these Janes appear and Homer's just not being able to fit any of them except this one which he actually fits really good in and he sees that snake is there and yeah he manages to deal out some justice though like pretty crazily but he's being chased by the cops, and yeah, the Janes can talk. <laughs> and talking about this planet as well, where his inhabitant, his people are getting soaked. And yeah, Homer wants to impress Marge. And yeah, dancing. And yeah, they managed to. They managed to get together very goodly. But. 
Marge has realized that Homer has not even taken off his pants for for so many times, and yeah, of course Homer is not knowing what to do, and yeah, he starts just pouring beer into his pants, or onto the pants of his mouth, and yeah, she takes off the jeans, and he realizes what she did, and. Yeah, the James is going out to kill Marge, he, literally choking her, making, causing Homer, making her to choke her, and he stabs a knife into his leg, <laughs> just to try to get the James off, and going into other people too, and eventually going up to Marge and about to get Marge, but then Homer basically just dumps Marge. <laughs> Saying after this speech, he was like, eh, I wasn't talking to you. And yeah, just go back with the James. And yeah, him just talking about, the James talking about how he is releasing all the other James from his planet to Earth. But yeah, quite an interesting Treehouse of Horror, I can say. I do like the stories that were told on this season's Treehouse of Horror. But yeah, I'd like to know what y'all think. Catch you on the next one. And also, right quick, right quick also, I wasn't sure exactly if there was going to be an episode this week. Because, you know, normally they would skip a week for a, like, for a holiday or something. A certain holidays or something. And the whole, I didn't think, I actually wasn't sure if they were going to do an episode this week. Just because of the week being of the election, right? The presidential election week. I wasn't sure if they were going to do an episode this week, but they did. Again, I wasn't too sure exactly, because, you know, some weeks they would skip they would skip a week for, like, a holiday or on a certain holiday and or certain thing happening. So, yeah, I wasn't sure exactly, but, yeah, we it did manage to come out. 